So many memories here. From kindergarten at Donaldson to senior year at AHS. Yeah, first time we had class together was in Miss Beasley's class in eighth grade. How can I forget? We got in a huge fight September 15, 2017. How do you even remember that? It's saved in my Snapchat. Where have you two been? We need our hosts for the last This Is Arlington. We're just talking about the memories. Old memories? We can make new memories out there in the studio. But Nathan. Jack. The next words I want to hear out of your mouth are this is Arlington starts now. We're going to go in there. You two are going to get yourselves together. We're going to film a show. Welcome to This Is Arlington, Arlington High School student produced television show. I'm Jack Perry. And I'm Aspen Bailey. It's our final show of the school year. Without further ado, let's take a look at our top stories. Friday the 22nd, the senior class finally got a proper send off. The day started out with a senior walk that took us through all the hallways we hold so very near and dear to our hearts. Following the senior walk, the class got Chick fil A, played a variety of games, and were able to finally have a stress free day. The day ended with the seniors getting their yearbooks and getting out of school early. One man's trash is another man's treasure. The fashion and environmental clubs proved that this past week with the Trash and Show. These clubs have been collecting trash since the beginning of the semester to turn into the items fashionable clothes. Riley Hadsky and Miss Brown have been working hard to bring the show together and it was a hit. There were outfits made out of trash bags, poster boards, Kroger bags and much more. Arlington High School will have a new principal next year. Mr. Duncan will be taking a new position at central office. While we're sad to see Mr. Duncan go, we're happy he will still be working closely with our school. Here to give us a closer look at Mr. Duncan, here is Tiger Life reporter Justin Byers. Thanks, Jack. Mr. Duncan has served as principal of Arlington High School since 2014. He has taken a new job at central office. While he may be missed here, he will still have an impact on our school system. Now, let's take a moment to highlight Mr. Duncan. I've been at AHS for about 15 years. I came over here after being a longtime coach at several different schools. I came over here in the fall of 07 as an assistant principal. Worked in that capacity for, I believe, till 13, 14 years. Then took over as vice principal in the fall and then moved to principal in the, for the spring semester. So. Uh, Duncan is a leader that is a no-nonsense kind of leader, but the things that he does that people don't see, like always taking a minute to pick up any piece of trash on the floor of the school and keeping this building beautiful has been one of his big priorities. And so that's the, one of the little things that I love about Duncan being at the school. Well, I've taken a position with the district. Uh, we'll be moving over to the board in a athletic director position for the district and I'll be over transportation. So it's some, definitely something new, you know, after 15 years of being an administrator and seeing a lot of negative, you know, it's just time for a career change. And um, even though I miss the relationships on a daily basis with students and teachers and even some of the parents. I think competitive, uh, loyal, and just somebody that really cares about, specifically in this sense, Arlington High School and the kids that go to school here. It's, I just made the decision to accept the position and, uh, Try to keep reaching for the stars. Thanks, Justin. This week we're taking a closer look at the speech and debate team. Here's a promo about the group from Tiger Life reporter Paul West. We have a meeting every month 
and most of the rehearsing is done on your own time. Yes, yeah, so we do go to the speech and debate tournaments. Um, sometimes they'll be like five, four hours away, and the other times it's just like around the corner at Bartlett. Um, it's really nice, really cool. You know, you meet a lot of common, um, you meet a lot of people who share like the same common interest as you, and overall it's just a really nice and good experience. Um, we put in a lot of work, a lot of time, all, all kinds of commitment, and I really, I think that we've done a great job continuing with all the challenges this year has presented and with having a new sponsor, I really think that we've done amazing in growing and trying to get people involved. I really love arguing and so public forum debate, it almost like gives me like an energy, I guess. Like after a debate, I just feel so excited. I'm like, yes, I'm energized, like say something else. Yeah, so I really love public forum. <laughs> I would recommend it to any theater students, anyone looking to grow their confidence in their public speaking, anyone who just wants to see what a team looks like, how they work together even if they are working on different things. Have you ever wondered what Arlington thinks? Well, now you get to find out what Arlington does think. Billables are in rhinoceros. Four? Yes. Rhinoceros. Four. 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 Yep. Four. Four. Correct. Rhinoceros. Four. Four. Why are you clapping? It helps me. Okay. What is 91 times two? Oh god, I don't know. 182? Yeah. 182. 93? Say it again. <laughs> oh, what's that? 182. Yep. How many sides are on a hexagon? Eight. Uh, like eight. Ten. Six. Correct. Second. Eight. Six. Six. Yeah. Who gifted the U.S. the Statue of Liberty? France. France? Alexander the Great. <laughs> Andre 3000. <laughs> uh, Italy? France. Who is Julius Caesar the Emperor for? Caesar Sandy? I don't know. Rome? Rome. The Roman Empire. <laughs> Who is the 16th president of the United States? Woodrow Wilson. States. Barack Obama for sure. Abraham Lincoln. Okay. Probably John Wilkes Booth. Abraham Lincoln. <laughs> and Frank. Bro. Farther away. Oh, you, know, you, know your yeah. you know your president's like that? Yeah, Lincoln. Abraham Lincoln. Yeah. Yes. High five. First try. Good work. Good work. Good work. <laughs> well, that was it for This Is Arlington. For the last time, alongside Donnie White, I'm Blake Lee, reporting for This Is Arlington. Thank you, Blake, for that report. It's time to drip or skip. Let's head over to Bailey Henderson and Dominic Ramos for their final report. Hey, y'all. I'm Bailey. I'm Dominic. And this is the last episode of Drip or Skip. And for that, we decided to put together a montage of some outfits here at Arlington High School. We hope you enjoy. I can spill so Smoke, I'm afraid I will drink a take of one molly water. So, but my sister say so. So, then my hate being sober. I hate being sober. Then my hate being sober. Wow, that was such a bittersweet moment, knowing that's our last episode of Drip Skip. 
I'm gonna miss interviewing all the students and especially my host, Bailey. I know, right? Who wouldn't? But I'm gonna miss working with you too. And if you're gonna miss us, feel free to watch the previous episodes filmed on AHS Tiger Life. We, we out. out. Thank you, Dominic and Bailey, for all of our seniors. This is their last TV show at Arlington High School. We wanted to take a moment and highlight them and look back on the year. What was your favorite part about senior year? Um, skateboarding in the gym and doing a lot of film projects. I've been doing the Spider-Man one recently and having fun with everybody that's graduating this year. My favorite part of senior year was doing karaoke in Miss Roberts' room. Uh, I think my favorite part is probably just playing soccer and just having that experience. Um, senior year, it was really fun. It was really adventurous. But towards the end, it got like, it's like, oh, I'm ready to go. The senioritis kicks in. But yeah, it was very enjoyable. It wasn't, it was one of the easier years of all the years I've been here. So I've really just been rolling with it. But it's kind of fun. There are 18 seniors in TV production this year. But if I had to pick my favorite, it would be an 18-way tie between all 18 of them. They're all my favorite. Love this group. This is my first TV group here at Arlington. Love you all. My favorite part uh, about senior year would have to be all of the classes that I took and um, all the friends that I um, did them with. Uh, my favorite part would probably be like the social life. Interestingly enough, like I, I got good friends, got like friends in all of my classes, but also like I know my teachers well enough at this point to just kind of be chill with them. Oh gosh, that's so hard. Who can do martial arts? I think my favorite work. is Jalen Cousin because he dresses up as Spider Man. My favorite part was probably helping lead Blue Crew, uh, trying to keep us out of trouble for the most part. Uh, that was probably the most fun, all the football games. But my favorite part so far has probably been where we took our class of 22 picture outside and we formed the 22. My favorite part about senior year is probably like the friends that I've made and like the people around me. Uh, my favorite part about senior year was probably the fact that I can end it and start doing what I actually want to do in life, like start getting money and everything, start my life out. My favorite part uh, during senior year, I guess, has just been the finality of everything, being able to, you know, broadcast for the final time, be able to do this and that for the final time. Yeah, it's kind of bittersweet, but it's also really nice to get kind of closure on this uh, high school journey. My favorite part about senior year was experiencing all the special activities that we got to do and dressing up for like senior week and then um, like playing my senior soccer season and getting to do like senior night and stuff like that. My favorite part about senior year is definitely getting a lot of classes with my homies because the past couple of years I haven't really gotten much but now I'm actually, I actually have classes with folks that I know so it's definitely a lot more fun. Might just be the fact that it's ending. I finally can like get past school, though there's a little bit of fear with going from school 12 years to completely new like lifestyle. My favorite part about senior year has been going on college visits because they've been super interesting. My favorite part about this uh, senior school year was that I got to uh, meet more friends and uh, draw more art. Graduating. My favorite part about senior year is probably all the friends and like football games that I got to go to and all that kind of stuff. My favorite thing about senior year is probably soccer, school soccer. My favorite senior in TV production is Justin Byers. Go! Go! <laughs> and the reason I chose Justin, and I'm brutally, brutally honest with this, is that he is dependable. He's fun, he does great work. Not only does he do the work that's assigned, he helps other people with his work. Um, and he absolutely adds a dynamic to the class that cannot be replicated. Hello everybody, I am Mr. Ashby and I am here on the set with all of the seniors of this is Arlington, our first season of This is Arlington. These have been the people who've been making this show happen all year long. And we've got a big group of people leaving us. A lot of these people I've been with since their freshman year, like Blake here. Some people I, I just got to know this first year. 
but I love this group of people. In my first year teaching TV production, I wouldn't pick a different group in the world. I love you all, and I wish you nothing but the best, my seniors. Did we have fun this year, seniors? Yes. Yeah. All right, okay. So are you all gonna watch next year? Yeah. Okay, all right, okay. Maybe. Well, we're, we'll be back next year with more episodes of This Is Arlington. Have a great summer, everybody. Bye-bye.